all right are you ready it's time for upper body training let's tone those upper muscles upper body muscles are you ready if you are ready i am damn ready now do not be afraid because this is beginner friendly workout that's what we do on this channel we're not going pro pro we are starting from scratch so even if you don't know what to do you're worried i go to the gym i don't know what machines to use i am here to help you out with all of that you are going to be seeing the machines that we're going to use today and trust me if you're just starting out anywhere from eight reps two times it's okay but i actually did 12 reps three times but just start with what you can you can do 12 some people do 8 12 or 15 reps okay so make sure you do each of the exercises three times before you move on to the next at the end you will have a toned back toned chest and toned shoulders right here i am getting ready because and also something else i want to add when you are training make sure that you divide your training into at least three parts the day you're doing your upper body focus on your upper body muscles today you're doing lower body muscles focus on that and then midsection and all of that so anyways that being said I'm warming up right now with this machine you can warm up with whatever you want to use to warm up at the gym because right now we're at the gym but you can still do these exercises at home if you have dumbbell or water bottles anyways today is gym and let's do that so i'm warming up with this machine this machine i'm using right here you can use it for your main workout also and this machine also you can use it in different ways where you're standing up hanging up like pull, pull ups and all of that can be done with this same machine but right here i love using it for warm up because it is quick and i can get to you know and it's not always occupied at this gym i attend so now the main workout starts okay right there it's me getting <laughs> So not across by my camera anyways so now i'm starting the first machine after warm up this is the first machine i decided to use most times i always change it or i always change it okay i don't always start with this particular machine i can start with the other double machine or whatever but anyways follow along and let me know in the comment section if you're just starting out this fitness thing and you're still kind of confused or you've been in the fitness uh family for a very long time and you're trying to see how you're gonna get motivations and all of that because sometimes you know starting out is difficult and keeping up also at some point you might want to just stop and do something else okay so at this point you can see i've moved from the first machine to the second one so if you are kind of confused and you don't know what to do watch closely and try to recognize the machines each of them that i will use so if you go to the gym and you're new and you want to do upper body training also you will be able to recognize the machines when you see them that being said let's keep this workout going let's get toned and let's stay healthy because as you know health is wealth it's not all about saying oh well hmm, i look fit i look this but keep that body moving keep those muscles trained it is going to help you in old age and it is also going to help you during your everyday chores everyday life as you wake up to go about your day you don't get that tired because your body is doing what your body needs or your body is getting what your body needs okay something else i want to add is when you're doing your workout do you actually work out like do you always do the whole body because i see a whole lot of people do that even at the gym when they work out they train the upper body lower body midsection and everything every day every day every day do you do that if that's what you do i guess you should change it a little bit because your body needs rest so for example today that i'm training the upper body you can see that the only thing my legs are doing lower body is movement like walking from one place to the other and all of that so i'm not focusing on those uh, muscles so i think you should do same it helps a lot and if you're just someone that is starting out it will help you not to be so tired and give up because you see a lot of people say wow i started this whole fitness thing i was going to get fit i was going to lose weight i was going to do this i was going to do that but at the point i just quit when you hit it too hard you get tired faster like when you're going for a marathon you don't start with the highest speed at the beginning of the race right okay so it's same with this whole fitness thing you're just getting any start slow build up and keep it going all right 
So when you're focusing on your upper body, make sure you train, you get to all the muscles in your upper body as much as you can while your lower body is at rest that particular day. The next day, now you're moving to your lower body while your upper body is at rest, while you're toning the muscles in your legs and all of that, your arms is just there grabbing the machine or pressing your phone or doing whatever you're doing with your hands or your hands just laying down, holding the machine and all of that. But you're not walking your arms and your chest and your back that day. Then, while your leg is resting, you're walking your upper body and all of that. So we you take time to target the core muscles also okay so if you're doing it this way you find out that although everything works together but they are not specifically targeted at certain days and they are kind of resting while you're working on the other muscles that you need to work on but remember every muscle in the body needs to be worked on and try your best to do that at every given time let me know which is your best day is it the day you're doing your upper body lower body or the day you're doing a general workout where you're doing all together because with that you can also do if you're not always doing full body full body full body if you're kind of dividing it you can also do that thank you very much and that's it